Hello, my name is Eve. I'm a partner at Herbert Parkinson in Lancashire, where we make your John Lewis seven day service curtains. I would like to demonstrate how to hang and dress your pencil pleat, pinch and eyelet curtains. Carefully take your curtains out of the box. Remember, curtains should be hung sufficiently far from the window pane to avoid any condensation. I will now demonstrate how to hang your pencil pleat curtains. Before you hang your curtains, measure the total length of the curtain track or pole, including any overlap. Divide by two to give the correct width for each curtain. If your curtains include part or half widths, these need to be positioned on the outer edge of the window. Now your curtain heading tape can be drawn to the correct width. Start by securely knotting the inner edge of the heading tape. Pull the three cords at the outer curtain edge at the same time. Then gather the curtain in even pleats to the desired width. Tie off the cord and wind any surplus cord onto the cord tidy, which is included in the box. Do not cut the excess cord, as you will need to let the pleats out to dry clean your curtains. Check you have the same number of hooks on each curtain as sliders on the track or rings on the pole. Don't forget to count the fixed end stop. Insert hooks at equal intervals into the heading tape. Depending on preference, this may be top, middle or bottom pocket. Now your curtains are ready to hang. Before I demonstrate how to dress your curtains, I will show you how to hang your eyelet curtains. Gather the eyelets together, taking care to ensure that your chosen fabric is visible and not the lining. Remember, if your curtains include part or half widths, these need to be positioned on the outer edge of the window. Now your curtains are ready to hang. Release one end of the pole and slide the eyelets onto the pole, making sure the outermost ring sits between the fixing bracket and the decorative finial. Once again, before I demonstrate how to dress your curtains, I will show you how to hang your pinch pleat curtains. When hanging pinch pleat curtains, you will see that the hooks are already inserted and have been adjusted to your requirements. Should the hook position need to be adjusted, this can be done by moving the hooks down the slider from notch to notch. Should the hook need to be raised, move it down to the bottom of the slider until it comes off. Then reinsert the hook onto the top of the slider and move it down to the desired position. Additional pin hooks are included. These should be inserted at the end of each curtain. Now your curtains are ready to hang. Once again, if your curtains include part or half widths, these need to be positioned on the outer edge of the window. I will now demonstrate how to dress your curtains. Draw your curtains into the stacked position and tease the pleats into place. Starting from one side of the curtain, work from the top downwards, separating each pleat or fold by hand down the full length of the curtain. Once happy with the pleats, Tie strips of fabric loosely down the length of the curtain and leave for a minimum of 24 hours, depending on fabric type, to set the pleats. Thank you for purchasing John Lewis curtains. I hope you have found this demonstration useful and that you are pleased with your purchase.